Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I want to demo to you a quick project that I've been working on called Tails. And this is a Tailwind CSS page creator where you can drag and drop these design blocks onto the canvas and build out these nice marketing or landing pages for your application. So if you're unfamiliar with Tailwind CSS, it is the hottest CSS framework out there. Uh, you can visit it at tailwindcss.com. Since I learned this library a couple years back, uh, my productivity and uh, just how fast I can knock out some really nice looking web designs has just skyrocketed since learning this awesome framework. So be sure to check it out if you have not. I'm also using this new app called Mhm, mm and that's kind of what you're seeing right now. I'm kind of giving it a trial run. Seems pretty cool so far. Uh, anyway, so back to Tails. So this is a uh, page creator that you can drag and drop these design blocks onto the canvas. And I released this about a month ago. And since then, the response has been pretty amazing. I'm going to share with you my MRR chart right here. And you can see since releasing it last month, the MRR is kind of just skyrocketed, which is super cool. Um, so kind of hoping to, not really saying this to, uh, to brag, but hopefully to inspire other indie developers out there. So let's go back and I want to demo to you this project. So I can go down here and click launch. the. And once the app is launched, we have the canvas area right here. And then over here on the left menu, we have all the design blocks that you can drag and drop over to the canvas. So you can see that we have headers, heroes, logos, content, all the way down to FAQs, pricing, and free. So what we could do is we could just drag and drop a piece of content over here. And then we can also click on the gear icon. And we could then select, say that we want to change the color of this. We could simply remove these classes. And I could say that I want this to have a, we'll say text green 500. And then we can also modify the text right here. Say build, if I could type, build your awesome next great idea. So we can modify each of these design blocks separately. And then let's go ahead and just finish building out the. We have logos right here. So drag and drop that one there. Let's drop a piece of content. And let's drop features. One. Let's drop that on there. Uh, maybe we want a call to action. That call to action. Maybe an FAQ. Q right there. We'll do a pricing, drop it, and footer. Let's just do this white footer right there. So we have the whole page laid out in front of us. We can modify each block, but then we, when we want to export the page, uh, we can click on export and we can copy the HTML and then paste that directly into our project. Or you could simply download the file. Download the file, I could open it up and you can see that we have our nice landing page right here in front of us. Uh, built with Tailwind CSS, some of the interactivity uh, is using uh, Alpine JS. So you can just include that CDN link and you already have all this functionality. You can see that you can toggle the monthly and yearly plan. And then it is also fully mobile responsive as well. So if you were to go back here, you could change the size. So we could say we want to see what it looks like on an extra small screen. Uh, we also have the menu right here. And you can gar be guaranteed that it will look nice on any device. So that is pretty much the project. Um, I've had a lot of fun building it and I've just learned so much about Tailwind. Uh, I've built this on the tall stack. Um, I think it, you can check it out at tallstack.dev, uh, which is a Tailwind, uh, Alpine JS, Laravel, and Livewire. A really, really cool stack that I would recommend to anybody who's in the Laravel space or uh, just anybody who wants to rapidly build out some awesome application. So, in closing, I think you should check out my project. Uh, it's pretty cool. Um, uh, it's at devdojo.com slash tails. Um, I've been kind of just working on it as a side project for, I don't know, maybe five or six months. I started building some design blocks and I was like, oh, that'd be cool if you could drag and drop one on top of the other. And then it kind of just snowballed after that and turned into what you see in front of you. Um, so if you have any feedback, please let me know. Please uh, post it in the comment section below. And please check it out at devdojo.com slash tales. And I hope you guys have a great day. And I will talk to you later.